Hello everyone. Um, I'd like to share something that came to mind this morning as I was talking to a friend of mine. Um, I have like uh, about two, three people that came today and, and tell me about they were not feeling well and that they're, you know, some of them have um, uh, muscle, muscle pain and uh, just like me right now, I have mo my muscles aches all over. I, I have pain all over my body and I don't know why. And I was thinking, uh, you know, as I was listening to them and then I had another friend who called me and said, can you please pray for my mom? She's not feeling well, blah, blah, blah. And uh, she, I think she's going into depression. And uh, I've been hearing a lot of it, a lot of that uh, in these past two days. And then um, I was talking to my son's uh, teacher. And uh, she was telling me how beautiful was her weekend and the flowers and springtime. And I was thinking about spring. And spring is not a really, the beginning of spring is not that exciting for me because it's too much pollen. My eyes get so little because, so small because of the pollen. And then I have stuffy nose and then my whole body aches. It's something they're putting in the air or the pollen. Well, several reasons. The bottom point is that she got me thinking, you know, she was telling me about the beauty of spring, a spring and time. And then I thought, wow, it's true. And then I'm receiving all these phone calls from my friends and from different people telling me to pre please pray for them. And I thought, wow, you know, spring and, and you know, God make all things so beautiful and perfect. He uses everything to, to give us a lesson and to teach us something. So I thought, as, as I was in the kitchen, I thought, wow, springtime and we are like flowers in the garden of God. So if we think about it, when when spring comes, all the trees start shedding um, the pollen, the flowers, but then we can see the beauty. But the thing is that while we while these plants are shedding all of this, the pollen and everything that comes with it, um, people get sick. People get sick around. So if we compare ourselves with with a flower or as a tree, um, when springtime comes to our lives, uh, we shed a lot of pollen, a lot of things that we can get people sick around us. You can get people, you know, like tired of listening to us, so we might need prayer for someone because we're not feeling well. And that other people might be affected by the things that were coming out of our lives, but if we hang in there, we realize that then we hang in the, in the in faith in God and in His Word, then we realize that we become beautiful flowers. So our faith is not lost. So actually we keep the faith and people can see the beauty of God in us. So we become like a, a flower, a tree in His garden. So hanging there is, is just the only comparison that I can make. Um, like, yes, we are flowers in his garden, you know, and when spring time comes, yes, we shed pollen and we can get people around us very sick, uh, but but then the work of God in our lives, uh, it makes us so beautiful, so beautiful that people just want to be around us, and that's how I compare spring. Spring time, I see it, I used to see it with a lot of pollen, which is it, my whole car is like, yellow and my nose my eyes become so small but God teaches us through everything and I am so thankful for that so if you're going through something hang in there um, hang in there seek his word and uh, do everything possible to look the most beautiful flower that you can in his garden because he likes to see it goodbye